All right, folks, how you going? I'm parked up in a little kind of picnic area, surrounded by trees, kind of in a valley. There's got a little stream running down there. It's quite nice, very quiet here today. I've got a mate of mine calling over later. I told him I'd cook him a slow roast leg of lamb in the Dutch oven. So I'm going to get that on shortly. It's going to take a few hours, but only problem is I have no signal here, phone signal. He was pretty good for showing up, so I have I have a lot of confidence in him, but you see what happens guys. Okay, so unfortunately the knuckle is too big, not fitting in the pot. So, it's time to get hardcore. The poor axe. You won't mind. You won't know until after. Alright, that lamb is getting some nice colour on there, so I'm just going to throw some cloves of garlic in. I didn't even feel them, and I've got some carrots, onions, and parsnip. A bit of celery in there as well. I'm just going to pop a sprig of fresh rosemary in there and add water and leave it off. You just arrived. Say hello, Hugh. Hello. <laughs> yeah, so the lamb's been on now about, uh, must be two hours at this stage. So uh, I'm going to start throwing in uh, some of the veg. So I'm going to put the carrots in first because I kept them nice and chunky. I'll throw in the celery, parsnip, and potatoes a little later. Just gonna mix some flour and oil together just to form a little roux to thicken the stock in the pot. Morning folks, just for making myself a cup of coffee, warm myself up a bit. Chilly enough last night, had to put the diesel heater on at about, I say, 6 o'clock this morning. 
So I'm just getting breakfast on the go. I'm gonna keep it simple this morning, just have some toast, bacon and eggs and some black pudding. Not a beautiful morning in the van. I deliberately did a long slow cook yesterday. I think the lamb took four hours in the end. I just fancied chilling out around the van and doing nothing. And that's basically what I did. I didn't want to be running around up in the mountains. I didn't want to be doing too much filming. But that's, that's life in the van for me as well. I'm not always up in the mountains running around. I'm not always chasing rivers and stuff. It was nice to just kick back, especially catching up with you. We don't always catch up, we work opposites, so it was nice just to chill out and kick back and do nothing. So look guys, I hope you enjoyed the video and we'll catch you again soon, alright? Cheers guys!